Hey, this is Ed with GI Tactical. Today I want to talk to you about Operation Reaper Venom. This is an event that's going to be taking place not tomorrow, but a week from tomorrow. So time is uh, getting close. It's going to be an amazing event. Um, basically what's happened is a chemical weapon's gone missing. We've got US CDC scientists on the ground. They're searching for the weapon. There's going to be several different forces, good guys, bad guys, crazy guys. They're all going to be out there on the field, all with their different missions. So it's going to be a lot of fun. Now, there's some other great things that are going on. We're going to have a dunk tank. So you get to throw and try and dunk myself, Jay. In fact, everyone from the GI staff is going to be there. You're going to get to try and dunk them. I do believe we've convinced Eric uh, from Exxon. He's going to be a, uh, another target of dunking. So that's going to be a lot of fun. Um, there hasn't been a lot of information out about the op and I think one of the big reasons why they're trying to keep it slightly mysterious is just like any real op, not a lot of information is given out until you're actually on the AO, the area of operations. So kind of like the real military, nothing's going to be out there until you show up. You've just got a general idea of what's going on. So we know there's the CDC. You saw Jay made up as a zombie, so CDC and zombies. It's not going to be a zombie game, but there's going to be the makeup guys from Blood Lake. They're going to be there making up some zombies. So it's going to be a lot of fun. There's a lot of people that have put a lot of time and effort into this. All of the money that's raised is going to be going to two charities. The first, very near and dear to us, X-Zone. Uh, X-Zone does a lot of great work. Uh, they're very quiet about it. Uh, they don't like a great deal of publicity, but they do a lot of work. It's a great, great charity. The other one, we just celebrated 4th of July yesterday, and to me, over here, 4th of July, yes, it's an independence from England, but who got that independence? It, it's the military, and Hugs for Heroes is a very, very, very good charity that supports uh, all of the US troops abroad in many different ways. It's a really good charity. So all that money that's going to be raised from ticket sales, from dunking sales, all of that, that's all going to be divvied up between these two charities. So we have a week left, uh, and I really, really, really hope we can really get some great numbers. You know, Reclamation was one, two, and three. We had two, 300 people out there on that field. I would love to see uh, the smiles on the people from Exxon's charity and Hugs for Heroes. If they could see that kind of a turnout for this game. So well worth it. It's going to be a ton of fun. You can find out more details, sketchy as they may be, on GI Tactical's Facebook page. You can go to Exxon's Facebook page. Tickets are only being sold through Exxon's Facebook page. There'll be a link. Uh, just follow that link and you can sign up for those tickets. So all of us hopefully look forward to seeing all of you next Sunday at Exxon for Operation Reprevent.